My father is originally from Aalborg, Denmark. He immigrated to the United States in rural Minnesota. He met my mother while she was studying abroad and decided to move back to rural Windham, Minnesota. So that's where I grew up and that's where I was born and raised. I've been celebrating my Danish roots my entire life. It's very much a part of who I am. What I love about the Danish table is that I really want to teach people to just slow down <laughs> and enjoy. And that's one of the things that I really appreciate about the Danish culture is that they enjoy their meals. I really want people to just take a second to connect with the people who are around the table and, uh, and connect with food. It's such a comforting thing and all of our emotions are tied to food. So to be able to bring that to the Danish table is just really why I'm here. <laughs> I love the design part of it. The design part of a restaurant is so important as well. And I really wanted to give a Scandinavian modern but comfortable take to uh, here in Elkhorn and uh, really continue to give the, the Danish culture and Danish roots that Elkhorn celebrates and continue them in, and keep them relevant in modern America so that we can, can remain relevant even for young people too and just kind of keep that uh, cultural heritage alive. I, I wanted it to feel like you were walking into a place in Copenhagen or Denmark, but still comfortable, like you were in somebody's home. As far as the menu goes, I wanted it to be comforting, something that I knew rural Americans would really appreciate, meat and potatoes, you know, those types of things that are, are so comforting and, and simple. And uh, food should be simple. When my, my mother passed away last year and she had a Danish cookbook and so as I started to get older I would ask her for Danish uh, recipes and she would always say use this uh, Danish cooking cookbook by uh, Viking chef Stee Hansen. And that book was in our kitchen for the last 10 years. And that's where I would pull Danish recipes to make them for my own family and she just really thought that that was a great interpretation of her family recipes in uh, US measurements and US products. It was just easy for us to, to replicate some of those things. So when I saw that Stee, Chef Stee Hansen was going to be at Tivoli Fest, I thought I need to take her cookbook to be signed and I need to tell him how how amazing his cookbook was and how much it meant to my mother and how that really allowed me to be able to carry on my uh, Danish traditions in the kitchen uh, now that she was had passed that's how I'm here about three days later he called me and and said you know would you be interested in opening a Danish restaurant you have your restaurant in Minnesota and uh, so I just, I can't help but think it was my mother <laughs> just kind of inching me along and uh, kind of giving me an opportunity to continue celebrating our Danish roots that were so important to her. It's just so amazing to, you know, to have that connection now and to know that I can, you know, continue celebrating uh, my Danish roots in, in the kitchen and professionally and personally.